Hello, fellow kids. It is I, your old friend Zelrog, hosting another Brawler Court event for the first time in forever. And this is uh, another unusual one. We've hosted a few unusual ones in the past. Uh, this is a crew battle between the Me Brawlers and Robin Cord. Except I probably shouldn't say the Me Brawlers because this is a character-free crew battle. Which basically means that we can play whoever we want to. And it's just Brawler Cord and Robin Cord having a throwdown. The stakes have never been lower. You can see I have my, uh, my chosen brawler down there in the bottom right. He's a little lumpy-faced. I got him from uh, the recent Metopia. But I love him. He's my favorite iteration of me brawler. This being a very casual event, it is also a little less organized than usual. So uh, we don't have set character order or set player orders yet. Everyone's just kind of uh, going by the seat of our pants. Hello, Maxime. Can you hear me? Let's go ahead and post that and make sure. Hello, Darian. Hello, Woko. Start to see people uh, trickling in. It's been a while. How you been? So who are our brawler players? We have Esquire. We have Jersh. We have Aztec, Woko is in this, Ava, and myself. And BMZ is on sub, so uh, last I heard Esquire was not here yet, so he might need to be subbed in. I suggested we all go Ganon, but the brawlers weren't into that. Some of them. Some of them were. We had about a 50-50 Ganon ratio. There's a weird amount of crossover between uh, Ganon, Bowser, and Brawler, which are the three characters that I play. I think it's because they all get a lot of reward off of their moves. They're a little cheesy. It's just that, you know... Bowser sucks a little bit for his cheese, and Ganon sucks a lot of bits for his cheese. Well, Brawler just kind of gets off scot-free. You get some free cheese. Good cheese, that Brawler. Looks like they have our first two players, and they're working out stages right now. Would I be welcome in this one? Uh, Darian, this is something that people signed up for ahead of time, so it's not, uh, it's not like a drop-in kind of thing. These are events that the character chords, for the, the Smash chords, tend to organize. They've been slowing down of late because the game, you know, it's finished its DLC. The game is slowing down of late. It's all about multiverses now. How do you guys feel about that? New people, I haven't talked to anyone about it. I don't like it. I seem to be the only one, because everyone else loves it. Don't let me tell you how to feel. We had a pretty even split. A few people on Twitch, a few people on YouTube. I see, I see someone posting Bridget's. There is a Bridget in the crew battle chat. BMZ is in chat explaining the uh, bands and stage picks. Our first player has never been in a crew battle before. I 
I don't recognize either player, so I don't actually know who's who. Does anyone know which of these is, I think Aztec is our first Brawler Chord player? I think it's Perfumer, but I'm not positive. It is better than Nick All-Stars. That's a very low bar, but I will give you that. And Nick All-Stars is still better than Punch Time Explosion. Boy, that was a trash fire, that game. What was that on? That was on the... The final version of that was on the Wii and the PlayStation 3 Cartoon Network Punch Time Explosion. I think I had it on the Wii, and we never got around to streaming it. Which is a travesty, I know. That game deserves to be seen. May or may, may not be obvious. I uh, started using a compressor since the last time I've streamed, so hopefully... I sound a little bit cleaner than usual, and I can pop off without destroying everyone's ears. Just a little bit, a little popping off. Still working on stage picks, stage bands. Aztec Bands, Final Destination, and PS2. It's a little weird to still have a Small Battlefield and PS2. I, I guess in the same sense that you would have North Cave and Kalos, but uh, I prefer smaller stages. Given the choice between the two. I like Small Battlefield, I like uh, Northern Cave. Multiverses has confirmed a hitbox update because apparently they were uh, just big pills before now. I, w I don't know if that had anything to do with the game feeling clunky to me. Maybe it did. Maybe it'll feel great now. Alright, what is their pick? Sounds like they're going to Battlefield and I have no idea who anyone's playing. All right, so we have Robin and Terry, and I'm going to assume, unless this is a cruel joke on Perfumer's part, Perfumer, Perfumer, that uh, they are the member of Robin Cord. Ooh, that's some, uh, that's some network. Boy, is that something. Is this going to be playable? Are we going to need a sub? Oh, I'm not going to be even be able to watch it. Well, this is a first. I guess they're still playing. They're both still in. I do. We just can't see any of it. Keeping the uh, chat updated. We can give them another chance to try. I'm, I'm willing to give them one more shot. Otherwise, I don't know. Again, this has never happened before. I've streamed, I don't know, six to eight of these uh, Brawler Core crew battles. Probably more because we had the three, uh, the three up B crew battles. And we've never had a match just drop like this. Hello, J Bogues. J Bogues?
I don't know if they're uh, they're reading chat. I think they're just still going at it. Oh, whoops, that's not where I wanted to go. We don't need to watch- hey, let's watch uh, Wickersham's last Smash stream, that could be fun. Yeah, here we go. Now we're having fun, now we're cooking. How are you guys doing? You like Smash? I like Smash. I love watching Smash. Love watching uh, circles in an arena going at it. Circles v circles. Look at all those circles. I'm watching. They're still at it. Nothing's changed. Oh, there we go. There's something. Alright, so what are we doing? Uh, okay. So, uh... One of, one of them claims to have, uh, like, it stabilized and they won 3-0. I guess they could send it to me and I could put it in and post. It just wouldn't have me commenting over it. Well, apparently the winner was Toner, so Yober, Uber, Sumber, the Bridget. Bridget wins. Bridget always wins. And I don't know which one Yober is. I think it was uh, Perfumer? Well, I guess I should update the score.
That was a very anticlimactic beginning. I'm sure the rest will be great. We'll just have a we'll, we'll have a 15 a 15 person crew battle. So uh All right, Jersh is our next brawler. I like this track. It's a good Fire Emblem track. It's probably not from Robin's game, but I don't know if Fire Emblem games are all the same, right? Probably just made some enemies with that comment. We going? We ready? All right, here we go. Jersh, the me brawler, versus perfumer Yober, the Robin. Three, two, one. Do the Mario. They're doing a quick lag test. Thunder. Understandably, after last match. Wobbin. Wobbin. Wobblin. We good? And then, traditionally, one will taunt to begin. A lot of us will be playing Robin. Oh, well, that's no fun. Oh, what, what is this? Is this the Mario Maker? This is the Mario Maker track. It's cycling bet between the, the different musics. Thunder. Thunder. Okay, we going? Here we go. I guess we're going. I think we've started and just no one wants to approach. Okay. No, we're starting over with a full timer. Which I guess is fine, but hopefully we don't need the full 10 minutes of timer. Dominating brick victory. That's right. That that was the match. We get we caught up. 15-15. Let's go. All right, for reals this time. Jersh, the me brawler versus Yober, the Robin. opening with plenty of nares and detilts. Trying to get them early combos in. Yober going for lots of grabs as well. I have very little Robin knowledge, so... Commentary might be a little bit off with Robin. Ooh, there's a platform trap. Lots of hopping. Ooh. Dodges the thrupper. That probably would have ended him at that height. Robin. Yober getting the uh, edge in percentage. Increasing the gap with Nosferatu and... Was that a Nair to finish? 
Gersh now down a stock. Mmm. Gersh rocking the uh, burning drop kick. That's not too common. A lot of up smash. Very odd. On uh, Robin's part. Mm -hmm. Nair into detail. Into Nair. Mm, burning drop kick gets interrupted and straight into another up smash. Jersh now down two stocks. Ooh, Robin avoids the F smash. I don't think that would have killed even at that that close to the ledge, but uh, there we go. There's an F smash. This is a this is a close fight. This could still go either way. Jersh punishes the shield with a grab. He's got Robin stuck in disadvantage. Mmm, misses the uh, misses the spike, and another F smash. Jersh takes the match. He's down two stocks, so the Robins are still ahead. It is now fifteen to thirteen, Robin's favor. Alright. I hate Wi-Fi GG's. Oh, Yober was uh, not happy with playing online. So Jersh is now with one stock remaining, and we're going to see our next Robin come in. Darn, I lost. Alright. Jersh and my name is funny. Assuming that their Discord name did not fit in the uh, Smash character limit. Jersh banning Town and City and Kalos. My name wants to pick Hollow Bastion, which I don't think is on the stage list. Why isn't it? I like Hollow Bastion. It's a good stage. Ah. It sounds... Oh. Oh, we're going to Yoshi's. We're going to Yoshi's against a thrust uppercut brawler. Ready? He's only got one stock. Maybe Robin will survive. Alright. Jersh the me brawler versus My Name is Funny, the Robin. Jersh will begin by taking out two stocks because he is starting with only his one remaining. And then they will presumably taunt to begin the match. No, oh, Robin. Y'all ready? All right. Yoshi's famously very good for thrust uppercut brawler because of the short ceiling. 
and platforms, allowing for uh, allowing for ladders. Can he get Robin up there? There's another male Robin. We haven't had any females. There he goes. The thrupper on Yoshi's. He's get he's taking a lot of hits though. Robin's in a dangerous spot, but with just one stock, Jersh is still very vulnerable. Mm -hmm. Going for the uh, faint jump kick. If he misses, that's a lot of end lag. My name, charging lots of thunders. Very projectile-heavy Robin. Trying to keep his distance with uh, Thunder and uh, the Fire spell. I'm, s I'm sorry, I don't know Robin. Jersh misses the dare. He's trying. He's trying to chase. Robin is keeping the distance. Oh, oh, jab lock. Oh, doesn't hit the f, f smash. My name playing very defensively. As one does in this game. As one does online in this game. Arc fire. Thank you, sweetie. Mmm, FMP. I didn't know he had that. Has he used a... Uh, I don't think he's used his neutral special before now. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Avoids the thrupper. That might have killed 23%. I don't... I don't know. That might have still been too low. So, FMP. Burning drop kick. Thrust uppercut and faint jump. Mmm, he's going for it. He wants that thrupper. I can't blame him. Go for grab. Come on. Dethrow Thrupper. Oh. Mm, still alive. He ain't out. There he's out. Okay, he's out. All right, that is one more off the Brawlers and two off of the Robins. All right, Robin's still ahead by one. And just because I think we're about we're about due for a halftime show. I'll go next. I offer myself to thee. Now waiting for my name to ban whatever stages. All right, banning Yoshi and FD. What are our stages? I like FD. Oh well. What do I want to pick? Hmm. Mm hmm. I like FD. FD's my favorite stage. I hate platforms in this game. Platforms in Ultimate are awful. I get what they were trying to do. I get that they didn't want you passing through them by accident, but... Oh no, I... 
was talking about FD. I picked FD. I don't want to do that. I do want to do that, but I can, I'd get in trouble for doing that. Small battlefield. And mixing things up with Brawler's older brother. I am a Bowser main Brawler sub. Unbased. Oh, come on! It's a character... What's the point of a character for crew battle? If you're all going to be the same character. All right, now Fu is down to one stock. So, uh... We'll go down to his one stock, and then we will begin. Now, platforms are sticky. You get stuck on them all the time. All right, we ready? No one expects the Bowser Inquisition. We going, you and me. I was really hoping. That wasn't a smart thing to do. That was a, that was a goofy thing to do, but I did it anyway. I want I want that cheesy F smash. I also got to be careful about getting spiked though. He can uh, that up special. Now don't eat me. Nope. You're going down. Mm, ate that. I don't want to eat that. Oh no! The buffered air dodge! Deserved. Y'all like my sick gamer skills? Well, hey, it's tied up now. 12 to 12. Alright, I promise I will take the next match more seriously. I, I was goofing a bit. I was, I was being a goofy Bowser. Okay, so now I ban. Let's see, I get three bans. What do I not like? Hmm. I don't really like PS2, but do I want to ban it? Yeah, I will. I know I want to ban Kalos, and I want to ban Northern Cave, because... I don't hate Northern Cave, but I don't like the platforms overhanging the, uh, the ledges. They mess with my, uh, they mess with my, my, uh, Bowser down special, and they mess with my sack cheese. Mm-mm, love me some sack cheese, soaring axe kick. Sounds like Fantasy is the next Robin. Man, you put me into a Bowser. Oh, you don't like fighting Bowser? Battlefield it is. I, I get some people who complain about Bowser. He's, he's got a bit of cheese to him. But, uh, you know what? He's not one of the most complained about characters. Like, he's not top ten most complained about. Which is proof to me that you can make heavies good and not have them just destroy the game. So, give us more of those next game. Come on, Smash 6, make Ganon viable. Please. Maybe I, I want to play DK. I want to play K. Rule. I want to be able to play them and not die immediately. All right, here we go. Myself as knockoff brawler. 
fantasy as knockoff Robin. That's not true. Corrin is nothing, is nothing like Robin. Bowser versus Corrin. And we can start immediately. Mmm. Oh, I missed all of that. Getting juggled as Bowser does. Get out of here. Mmm. Ooh. I didn't expect him to pursue. I don't have a lot of experience against Corrin, I will admit. I'm going for too many of those. I'm also rolling too much. Mm. He moved just enough to avoid... I also got to be wary about his counter. Get out of here. Urgh. Urgh. He's got more air drift than I thought. I'm going for Hail Marys that I shouldn't be going for. I'm going to be candid. I feel a little bit outmatched. I'm okay. I'm not that good. There we go. Please. Okay, one stock. Maybe I can keep the momentum. Maybe I can get his habits now. There we go. Yeah, buffered A dodge. Buffered air dodge. My secret technique. I take those. No, roll right into that. That's bad. <gasps> Don't like that. No, sir. It's still possible. It's not looking good. <clears throat> yeah, there we go. Get that damage. Give me that fire breath. Come on. Side B. I know you want to. Shouldn't be fishing for that. I gotta mix up a little bit. I also am not using my uh, side B out of shield the way I should. I gotta jump and uh, use it out of shield. Dropping my shield makes it take much longer. <laughs> Not now, phone. Now is not the time for the phantom. I am dead. Well, I tried. I got two. So, let's see. That's another three off the brawlers. And two off of the robins. I got three. I went again. I could have done worse. <laughs> Even though two of them were to completely undeserved buffered air dodges. It's okay. I'm Bowser. The plan is to outlast them. I just gotta survive long enough for them to screw up. That's the, that's the strat. Alright, who's next? Sounds like Woko next. Ooh.
it's entirely possible that no that the people after Woka won't get to play. Woko is a very scary brawler. Although maybe he's not playing brawler. In this kind of special event, we don't know who's playing who. Which I thought was the point, but then I played Bowser and someone calls and comes in and gives me grief for it. You've seen my brawler. I've, I've, been, in, I've been in all the brawler crew battles. I haven't hosted any Ganon Cord or Bowser Cord events. Ganon Cord tend to... to he, they tended to not do them as much after I joined. No causal relationship, granted, but... Uh, I think they just didn't do... it. They, they kind of blew their load on events early on. And then they slowed down. Pretty quickly. I could almost say the same for Ganon as a character. Everyone was so excited when Ultimate came out, that, hey, look at all this new stuff he's got. He's finally good. He's finally viable. And then, yeah, pe pe people learned. We figured out that was that was not the case. <laughs> Ganondorf is just... A, Ganon Court is just a place for grumpy old disappointed men now. And women. Probably women. Fantasy and Woko next working out stages. You coming, Woko? Oh, Fantasy is Chinese. Well, you know what? That wasn't bad for uh, literally the opposite side of the world. I'm West Coast US. Fantasy is Chinese, and uh, Woko next is in Mexico. So it's going to be a stellar series of matches. Almost as good as that first match we had. The one we didn't see, I'm sure that was great. Which uh, might not make sense on YouTube. Uh, apparently the person got... They saved the VOD, so they will be sending that to me, and I will... I guess I'll just have to edit it in and post. So, won't have commentary, but it will be in the video. Enjoy the operatic vocals. There's there's Woko, he's coming. Fantasy asking if they get a free stock. No, sorry. But it, those buffered air dodges are my strategy. Those those are victories for me. You can't let you you can't take those from me. I don't have my uh, meat friends in the stands anymore. I had a uh, clean install of OBS, I believe. So they're gone. Unfortunately, you know I could re-add them. Let me see what I can do. While Wolko takes his sweet time to get in here. There he is. Look at him. Isn't he adorable? Let him closer. Let him into your life. He just wants to be your friend. Everyone loves Kirby. Why can't everyone love him? I think someone left because of that. <laughs> Alright. 
there's the uh, there's the match that got cut. What is that thing on stream? That thing is terrifying. Oh, I have more of them. I used to have them all up in the stands in the previous like crew battles and things. All right. Ooh, me gunner. That's new. Well, I guess it's not new for Woko next. Woko play is all of the Mies. Like a gentleman. Giving us his set. 1113. Charge Blast, Flame Pillar, Lunar Launch, and Vortex. Lunar Launch? That's a little, uh, slightly less common. Not unheard of. Alright, Woko next. Moko, the Mii Gunner, versus Fantasy, the Corrin. With one stock remaining. Alright, here we go. Rocking out to Donkey Kong? Mm. I don't like I don't like that F smash. I've gotten caught in that. Y'all saw. I would say Me Gunner is my number four character. I like to consider them a pocket. Mmm, the bear Woko is taking hits. Can he pull it back? Uses Vortex to mix up the recovery. Mm. Jumps from ledge into an up smash, into an up air, and Woko loses a stock. Woko given all the fares, plenty of nares, lots of boxing. Woko is not a uh, keep your distance kind of gunner, at least not in this match. I am a shameless keep your distance kind of gunner. Mm -hmm. Doesn't quite catch the uh, ledge jump with Nair. He's got a full charge, whiffs it. Woko taking a lot of hits. Fantasy is at a decent percent. Woko's really struggling to get the kill, though. Oh, there's the up smash. That'll do it. It is fast, it is strong, and it's scoop. Fear the gunner up smash. Alright, so that is one off of Woko. And one more off the Robins. Robins maintaining a slight lead throughout this event. We are now down to 9 and 8. Robin favor. Woko banning Yoshi's and Smashville and Northern Cave. What other friends can I invite? Do I have any new ones? I don't think I have any new ones since last time. I have uh, I have Galarian Slow King, the Sith Lord. So, you know, that's pretty cool. There's something new. How come everyone was freaking out about Mario nipples, but no one cares about inkling feet? Just leave y'all to think about that for a little while. How long ago was the Mario Nipples thing? That was when that was before Odyssey came out, so that was what? Four years ago now? I'm old. Now 
Nobody cares about Kenna Ryu feet. Well, it's not weird for them to have feet. We see their feet all the time. We never see squid feet. It's fresh. Like fresh feet. Everyone does care about core and feet. That is very true. Wilco next. The Me Gunner versus Sage slash Simply Robin. Different Discord name. Wilco next is down one stock. And here we go. Boy, I have every music track enabled with equal likelihood on every stage, so we get, we get some interesting uh, interesting tracks on the FD and the battlefields. Hmm, Wolko with a bear. That he could have recovered from that, couldn't he? Okay, well, Sage is down to stock. Ooh. Fully charged Charge Blast goes straight through Thunder. Hell Thunder. A down smash into a Lunar Launch. Is he? He's just going to keep doing it. Okay, well, I guess that's why he, he use, uses Lunar Launch. I can speak. Mmm, up air. And that killed. Woko now has gone through two stocks, only at 53%. Delay? What? Well, yeah, it's, it's gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Up into the fire. How did that down smash hit? What was that hitbox? I guess that's, uh, Vortex is a good thing to have against Robin. At least projectile happy Robins. Mm -hmm. Can Woko cinch a three stock? Or can Sage take at least one stock off him? He can't just throw out projectiles because of Vortex. He's got to. He's got to think about it. Ooh, was that fair or bear? It does not quite kill Woko. He is so high, a hundred and fifty percent, and still kicking. He's going for a regrab. Gets away with it. Hmm. Just standing and shielding. Waiting for that up smash out of shield. He wants it. He has no shield left. There he goes. Woko loses a stock. I'm just, I'm enthralled. I'm watching how this is going to go. They're both at about 100. Robin has, uh, Sage has pulled it back. This could go either way. With a good string of attacks, they are now both at kill percent. The next good hit could decide it. Mmm. Oh. Vortex heals Woko a little bit, and he eats the up special. Sage has won it. That is two stocks off Woko and two stocks off Sage. I didn't forget to up update the scores, did I? That's correct. 7 6. Sage is now down to one stock. And we have two more brawlers coming in. So anyway, back to feet. Eggman feet. Eggman has nipples. Wario does not. This is canon.
This is this is important. I gotta look this up. Very important. Vital, some might say. Vital. Canon information. World changing. I'm, I'm shattering some people's entire worldviews right now. Between the Sego and Nintendo rivalry. It's I, It just goes to show. Sega does what Nintendo don't. Captain Falcon does, has, does have nipple hitboxes. Is uh, somewhat famous. Also famous, Little Max weird butt hitbox, the shit box as it's called. I think it's on his nair. And for some reason, We Fit Trainer has a little tiny groin hitbox in one of his or her moves. I think that might also be nair. I'm not positive which one it is. I would have to look this up, and I don't have the, uh... I don't want to download GIFs right now. GIFs, GIFs, Jiffy, peanut butter. Wait, hold on, I have a visual. I can I can squeeze it in. Come on, Obs. Before the match starts. I got it. There you go. There's the weird little little growing box. It has other names. I'm not gonna say them on stream. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Sage, the Robin, versus Ava, the Richter, right? I'm sorry, he, he looks too much like Ryu. All pretty boys with headbands look the same. Sage removes two stocks. And taunt to start. Alright, let's go. I don't see Belmonts too often. I have a couple friends who play them. Darian, who was here earlier, is a Belmont player. Hmm, Belmont edge guarding with Nair. I haven't seen that. Give him the dangle. It's your best move. Mm hmm. Going for that dare is a little bit risky with the disjoint on Robin's up air. Caught the sword, got a couple hits off of it. Richter de has the damage lead so far. Robin is catching up, though. Ooh, there's a good hit. Robin now at 112 versus Richter's 78. Robin taking more hits. Mmm. If he gets him out far enough. Come on, pull it back for the brawlers, Richter. I don't know what you- Oh no! That was enough! Richter, Ava, down a stock. Mmm, that's a bad disadvantage. He's back to stage, back in neutral, eating a lot of hits with the fire. He's just trying to close the distance again. Going for that, uh... Oh, that's why he's on Team Brawler. He has thrust uppercut, that's right. Mmm, okay, he's back on stage. Come on, break even. Need one more sage stock. Mm. Oh. He 
was knocked back to stage, but he accidentally fell past ledge. That is extremely unfortunate. He was doing so well, and then he, he just got Richtered a couple times too many. That is another three off of the Brawlers. The score is now seven to three. Sometimes you start a match great, and then it just falls apart. Or sometimes the opponent just uh, catches on to your cheese. I don't think that's what that was. I, I don't think that... Uh, I don't think Sage downloaded the Matrix and suddenly knew all of Ava's moves. It was just... Uh, it was just some unfortunate character interactions. Some Richter being Richter. Belmont being Belmont. I like Simon better than Richter. Possibly unpopular opinion. Too many pretty boys in Smash. Give me the Barbarian. Alright. Well, we're down to our final brawler. Sage issuing the same bands as they have been. Battlefield, Yoshi's, and Town and City. And who is our finer, finer, our finer member of Broader Chord? It is Esquire. If I remember correctly, is the founder of the Me Corbs. Sounds like they're going to Smashville. Maybe I can get one more in. Where is it? Give me a visual. I need the shit box. It's a weird image, but it's the only one I could find. Oh, Discord supports WebP now. Well, there you go. There's the, uh, there's the shit box. The weird, no reason, butt hit box that Mac has on his Nair. There's lots of funny hit boxes in Smash. Lots of funny angles, too. You should go check out Vishera Games for, uh, mods relating to all of those funny angles. Alright, here we go. This could... If Sage does well enough, this could be the final match. This could end 7-0. Hopefully that doesn't happen. Hopefully Esquire can bring it back at least a little bit for the Brawlers. Alright, Sage the Robin with one stock. Versus Esquire the Incineroar. Shadow the Hedgehog. Ultimate life form. He can do it. He can beat Sage. Mm, Nair through the thunder. Mmm. Eating lots of fire. 
But remember when elements were not very effective against Pokemon? Remember that was when that was a thing in Brawl? And how basically unutilized it was? That was a strange time. Mm -hmm. Nair Splash. Spin? Come on. Yeah, armor through. That didn't connect somehow. That was a strange interaction. Mm. Esquire makes it back to Sage. Sage has the damage lead. Can Esquire pull it back? I haven't seen any uh, any revenges yet. Ooh, almost buffered an air dodge off stage. Made it to ledge. Mm. Oh, is that it? Not quite. He tries to ledge guard. Oh, and he gets pineappled. Oh, that is so unfortunate. After an almost kill screen. Esquire still eating arc fire. He's so close. Is that enough? <laughs> that is, uh, that is some very preemptive kill screens. Come on, Esquire. I believe. Mmm, another stock. Lost to Arcfire F Smash. Sage being the MVP of this crew battle. Just a plain old dash attack at 160%. Finally finishes it. It is now Esquire down to one stock versus two more three stock Robins. Well, he, d he did win. It didn't end 7-0, at the very least. Not as if this means anything. Again, this is a friendly, no-stakes crew battle. But, uh, what's the fun if I say that out loud? I just woke up and got cheap-shotted by Book, says Esquire. BMZ. Upset that he did not get to come in and sweep the remaining seven stocks. Alright, our next Robin is Scale. Esquire bands Kalos, Final Destination, and Town and City. And scale selects PS2. All right, we good. Ready? All set. Esquire, the Incineroar, versus Scale, the Pit. Three, two, one, go! Esquire is down to the final stock for the Brawler side. I just woke up. How many people did Weed Robin kill? Was, was Weed Robin the, uh, the previous, the, the Sage? Because it was a lot, I think it was like seven.
scale. Keeping his distance. Making full use of Pit's disjoints. Which aren't huge, but they are disjoints. Mmm, body splash. People don't like those D smashes. They say they're pretty much all bad for one reason or another. I like them. I catch a lot of people off guard with them. But what do I know? I'm a scrub who gets all of his kills from buffered air dodges. Come on, Esquire. Back throw. Yeah. And, oh, mistimed? I bet that was supposed to send behind him. Uh-oh, uh-oh. He spins. Lots of arrows. Oh, is that up air? Still alive. He ain't dead yet. You can get one more stock, Esquire. I believe in you. There he goes. All right. You done good. You done all you could. Good job, Esquire. All right. Well, that is our final score. The Robins take the crew battle. With 5-0. Let's see if we can get BMZ in. Come on. Come on, BMZ. Scale's still in here. You can take him. Put up your dukes. How many on your crew are brawler mains? Oh, again, why why have a, f a character free crew battle if you're gonna give people grief for not playing the character? Why why would you just not have a brawler v robin crew battle? It sounds like that is the end of it. I tried to get us a, uh, I tried to get us an exhibition match, but I don't think that's happening. So, thank you guys for watching. That's our final score, five zero. Good games to everyone involved. Undeserved stocks and all. I got plenty of those. I got exactly two of those actually. But uh, always fun. That was for Brawler Court. I'll edit this in post. Hold on. Hold on. False ending. Just kidding. Are we getting our exhibition match? We're gonna get a BMZ match. Scale's gonna take them on. The final score is 5-0, but let's see how, how many BMZ can take. I want to see him go at it. Using me, Sword Fighter. That's new. We didn't see him today. Three, two, one, go! With Hero Spin. Ooh. Gale Stab. Reversing Down B. I always forget the name of it. And Tornado. A fairly typical uh, sword fighter move set. Hmm, not quite enough. Hero spin is a good good combo finisher, but it won't kill quite that early. Also, cheats for recovery, so a little bit of a trade off. Pretty even so far, though. the arena ID. Uh, this is not an open event. This is a smash court event, and it is uh, just about over. Sorry to say. Mm. 
BMC keeping that advantage up. Hero Spin, again. Not enough to kill, but it's free damage. Attempting a reverse edge guard twice, and the second one does kill. Maybe BMZ was the hero we needed all along. Maybe he could have taken those seven stocks for Brawl Accord. We had... How many, how many brawlers did we have? Was it just Jersh? Or did we have another one? It might have been only one me brawler of, of the six, seven of us. He's, he's gonna do it. It's a clean three stock. Oh man. We got we got to have our what if timeline. We got to see what would have happened if BMZ had. Uh, boy, we we wasted our sub. Our 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 gracious admin decided not to participate, and he he could have carried our asses. It sounds like the last Robin, the last Robin Corb member is willing to take a crack at him. So we'll see. All all six players on both sides have gotten to fight. That's nice. It's nice when that happens. Which it sounds like is Jegman. Oh yeah, Eggman feet. I'm sorry. Is the is is the Robin Cord member playing me brawler? All right. Let's end this with a nice ironic twist. <laughs> Eggman the slime. Is this the person that was talking about feet earlier? Is is that the last Robin? Alright. Last Robin Cord member, I should say. Clearly not a Robin. In this match. Hmm. He's doing alright. Even damage so far. BMZ gets the edge. Pun absolutely intended. Charging Gale Stab. I don't know if you can cancel that or not. And an F Smash for the first stock. Mm. BMZ is still alive. 120%. One more Up Smash. Probably not a Thrust Uppercut from the floor, but an Up Smash could probably kill him at this point. No, not quite. What else has he got? I haven't seen his neutral special yet. Okay, a thrust upper from a platform. That'll do it. Mm -hmm. Doesn't go for hero spin. There it is. Mmm, BMZ rocking those reverse edge guards today. I don't even know if you can even call him that, because the opponent was uh, not off stage. They were on ledge. Going for the rapid jab on shield. Fortunately, works out this time. Mm. There it is. Not quite. Ooh, he's still alive. There's a suplex. Surprised we haven't seen more of those. Okay, he's got FMP. Which I don't think BMZ is quite high enough to kill with even a fresh FMP yet. Up smash will do it. This is closer. This is down. BMZ is down to one stock. And that's it. So in this hypothetical universe, BMZ would have had one stock to Sage's one stock. This would that would have come down to the final one one for Brawler Cord and Robin Cord. Alas, it did not. Without our god BMZ, 
Brawler Cord lost 5-0. And thus ends the uh, Robin Cord versus Brawler Cord friendly character free crew battle. It was an impressive showing from BMZ at the end. Even if he didn't participate. Oh well. Thank you guys for watching. Always fun to host these. Uh, don't we'll see if maybe I'll host more in the future. It depends. Smash events are slowing down as the game also slows down. So we'll see what the future holds. That's it for me today. And maybe I will see you for a stream later or possibly tomorrow with Jack. Thanks for watching.